Hi everyone! Hi everyone, it's Teacher Heidi. It's Teacher Heidi's daughter. <laughs> Today we're gonna make memory cards based off of the Very Hungry Caterpillar. And um, to do this, we need to draw two of the same picture on the index cards that were in your art kits. And you can make these too. Yeah, hopefully you do. So I'm trying to remember, Lena, do you remember how many, how many apples? Yeah, one apple. One apple? So on two pieces of paper, I'm gonna draw one apple on each one. So I'm not the best at drawing apples, but I know the shape is kind of like this. And it's like roundish. It's roundish. So the reason why we're drawing one on each card is because we want, like we're playing memory, if we didn't say, and um, we're gonna turn them over and if we get two apples, let's say, um, we get to keep the cards and go again. That's right. So I drew two apples. Two apples, one on each. Now I'm done with that. What are you gonna draw, Elena? I'm gonna draw three plums. All right. So basically, on each card, I'm gonna draw three plums so I can get a match or teach a Heidi. So I'm just gonna make these plums. I'm not gonna make them too big because I don't want to take up the whole card. Because three is kind of a lot. So we're gonna want kind of like room for the three. So we can put like, you don't have to put too much like work into them, but like, so you can tell it's like the fruit you want it to be. Green for the, oh. <laughs> I'm gonna use the green for the stem on each plum. Now here are my plums. Awesome. We're gonna color the rest. Story about the goose. Nice to get off the hill. Oh, the kitty is so cute. Hi everybody, we're back and we have our memory cards. So, what's the first thing we should do, Elena? First thing we should do is turn them all over. Okay. Turn all the memory cards over. Next thing we should do is mix them up so we forget like which one's where and which like spot. Alright. Okay. And now we should lay them out. So it's easier to grab them. Perfect. And do we want to go first? Um, sure. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I'm going to pick this one, this middle one. I got strawberries, four strawberries. So, yeah, in the same spot. So you can see it. it over. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I haven't played this in a long time. Um, and I'm going to pick... This one, I don't know. Oh, I didn't get it. Two pairs, I got two pairs on this one, and I got four strawberries on the other one, so unfortunately didn't get a match, but your turn. Now I get to go. So I got four strawberries. Did we see four strawberries before? I can't really remember where it was. Maybe it was here. I'm gonna check. Oh, that was the two pairs. Two pairs. But now, I'm gonna turn it back over. So I remember teacher Heidi just got a strawberry right here. And I remember that I got a strawberry right here. So I think these two are the strawberries. Let me check. Yep, one strawberry. Put it back on this one. <laughs> and another strawberry. Yay! So I get to keep these <coughs> and I can put them like with me so I can keep them. And yeah. Now you get to go again? Oh yeah, awesome. So I'm gonna pick, hmm. Which one do you guys think I should pick? I'm gonna go for this one because it's in the corner. I don't know if that will help, but three plums. So. Put it back over. <laughs> <laughs> um, ooh, cat hair is getting my mouth. <clears throat> um, the plums, I'm gonna go for another corner. I'm gonna go for this one. Oop, 
I got one red apple. So I unfortunately didn't get a match because I got three plums and one red, whoops, ran away. <laughs> one red apple, so. But you gotta leave them where they were. You can't move them around, that way you can remember where they are. Just keep them in the same order. Oh, that's one apple. She got one red apple. And, oh yay! I made the match, I found the two apples. So now I'm gonna go again. Two, two pairs. pairs. No, I think the two pairs were, I remember seeing them. Same Do you here. think they were here? Or here? Or here? I think they were here. Oh, oh three plums. My turn. Okay, so I know that this is a pair, so I'm gonna flip this over. Get a pair. So I got two pairs, and it could either be this one or this one. So which one do you think I should pick? I'm gonna go for this one, because I think I remember the pairs being here. Oh, the pairs! So here are the pairs. I got a pair of pairs. <laughs> <laughs> and my pairs. So I'm gonna put them with mine and I can go again. So since there are two more, do you think there's a match here? I think there's a match here. So I'm gonna flip this over. Three plums. Three plums! Yay! Yay! Good game. Now, when we're putting our stuff away, if you made these cards and you put a lot of work into them, let's save them and put them in one of the folders that you got in your kit. Let me yeah. show you. That way your work doesn't go to waste and you can keep the project that you made. Can you show them how to put it in the folder? Yes. So our folder here um, and save the red apples um, and you can put it here. You see how these are, here, let me put these down really quick. You see how these are like these slots so you can put stuff in. We're gonna wanna take our pair, pears, um, but this is an apple and put it in together. That way we have them um, in all. And it's always good to remember how many cards you have so you can count them and make sure you have that same amount of cards the next time you play. So I'm gonna put these all in here so we can play this again. Hey Elena, here's a beautiful drawing that you did. Would you like to put it in the folder as well? Oh sure. I can save my work and see it whenever I want to. Bye everyone! Bye! <laughs>